Hello everyone, I'd like to share with you the trades that were posted on Thursday, 20th of July 2023. These trades were shared by RA from Seattle who is trading Dow Jones futures. The macro was in uptrend, so this structural chart is also in a strong uptrend. And you can see that he used 10 second trading chart to find entry and exits based on algo 1 to 5 and manage and close these trades with profit. Also, he posted a trade on NASDAQ futures and again the market is in uptrend and the three charts are aligned. So he identified this area of pullback and entered an exit based on exit strategy number one and closed it with profit. So the result of these four trades shows 100% win rate and the average winning trades were 111 and the largest winning trade was $191. So thank you RA for sharing your trades with us. The next trades were shared by AA who's trading Nasdaq CFD. As you see the macro chart is in downtrend and the price broke this channel and in this area that was seen as an uptrend in the structural chart and you see the uptrend channel there. So using a smaller 10 second trading chart he identified two areas of pullbacks and entered both and one was closed with a small loss and the other with good runner and the result of his trades is shown here. So thank you AA for sharing your trades with us. Next few trades were shared by HS who's trading Dow Jones in form of CFT. As you see the macro chart is in uptrend. You can see that in the five minute trading chart also. So using one minute trading chart he identified an area of pullback and entered multiple position and managed and closed this with profit. And you can see the result of his trades for the day here. So thank you HS for sharing your trades with us. The next few trades were shared by MG who's trading Dow Jones in form of CFT. As you see the macro chart is showing downtrend and broke down and using the structural chart you can see the downtrend channel and using a smaller trading chart here he identified several areas of pullback and entered based on algo 1 to 5 and managed and closed them with exit strategy number 1 with profit and the result of his trade is shown also here. Thank you MG for sharing your trades with us. The next few trades were shared by Sam or Global Instructor from Australia who's trading micro Nasdaq futures. As you see the market was in downtrend so using this tick chart which is a trading chart he identified the area of pullback and entered here and as you see it became a good runner and closed here with very good risk to reward ratio. The result of his trades shows that he reached 100% win rate with the average winning trades of $89. Thank you Sam for sharing your trades with us. The next few trades were shared by Yan or Global Instructor who is trading micro Nasdaq futures. As you see the macro chart is in sideways range expanding and at this point the sellers came back and he identified a downtrend channel and entered multiple search for positions and managed and exit them and again after a complex pullback when the sellers came back again in this area of the downtrend channel he entered multiple search for position again and managed and closed this also with profit so the result of his trades for the day shows that he reached profit factor of 47 with 89 percent win rate from the sell short positions and the average win to loss ratio was about six so thank you Yan for sharing your trades with us. The next few trades are those that I have taken during the New York market session and the video with detailed explanation was sent to students yesterday. So I'm going to replay the video here for you. Hello everyone. I'd like to share with you my trades today on Thursday 20th of July 2023. These trades were taken on NASDAQ and also Dow Jones and S&P 500 futures. If we look at the macro charts, we see that the price after reaching this level of high on S&P and NASDAQ started to go down. During the growth session, Dow Jones fluctuated around the previous day close and S&P and NASDAQ started to go down and uh, for NASDAQ was more bearish and went below the previous day low and close. And during the New York market session, the price started to go up initially and around 9.50, the sellers came back and pushed the price lower strongly on the NASDAQ below the previous day low. So I took sell short position uh, repeatedly in this area on NASDAQ and around 10.30 on Dow Jones. 
we see the pullback got completed in this bullish move and the buyers came back so these candles that are going up I took long position on Dow Jones and for S&P also when the sellers came back around 10 o'clock we see the first few candles here that couldn't reach the previous day close and it started to go down so I took sell short position on S&P 500 here so these signals were copied by copy trader to multiple Apex Trader funds accounts and we see the result of the day which was positive and we reached profit factor of 4.44 with 69% on average, 77% from long positions, and 65% from sell short positions. Most profits came from sell short positions, and the average win to loss ratio was 1.93, and the largest winning trade was 570, and the largest losing trade was $224. So, hope this trade taken by the PAN system is useful for you, and let us know if you have any questions. Have a wonderful day.